Your new vehicle may be equipped with an electric park brake system or EPB. Now, unlike conventional parking brakes, the EPB not only offers simple operation, it includes some additional features that make this park brake more convenient and useful. As you know, the parking brake is primarily intended to prevent the vehicle from rolling while parked. So before leaving the vehicle, make sure that the EPB is applied. Also make sure to place the transmission in park. You can engage the EPB manually using the switch located in the center console. To do this, just pull up on the switch momentarily. You can also have it engage automatically every time you put the vehicle in park by enabling the Auto Park Brake feature in the Customer Programmable Features section of the Uconnect settings or through the instrument cluster. Here's a quick note though. You may hear a slight whirring sound from the back of the vehicle while the EPB engages or disengages. And if your foot is on the brake pedal while you apply the EPB, you may notice a small amount of brake pedal movement. Once the EPB is fully engaged, the brake warning lamp in the instrument cluster and an indicator light on the switch will illuminate if the ignition is in the on-run position. If the ignition switch is in the stop mode, the brake warning lamp will not illuminate. Keep in mind though that the EPB can only be released when the ignition switch is in the on-run position. Now, if the auto park brake feature has been enabled, the EPB will automatically engage whenever the transmission is placed into park or with a manual transmission when the ignition switch is turned to the stop position. The EPB will release automatically when the ignition switch is placed in the on-run mode, the transmission is placed in drive or reverse, the driver's seat belt is buckled, and an attempt is made to drive away. To release the EPB manually, the ignition switch must be in the on-run position. Put your foot on the brake pedal and push the EPB switch down momentarily. Once the EPB is fully disengaged, the brake warning lamp in the instrument cluster and the LED indicator on the switch will go out. Your EPB also features Safe Hold. Safe Hold will automatically engage the EPB if the vehicle is left unsecured while the ignition switch is in the on-run position. Safe Hold will engage when all the following conditions are met. Speed is below 1.9 miles per hour or 3 kilometers per hour. There is no attempt to depress the brake pedal, accelerator pedal, or on manual transmissions, the clutch. Your seat belt is unbuckled, the driver door is open, and for automatic transmissions, the transmission must not be in park. This video is not intended to take the place of your owner's manual. For complete details and other important safety information, please see your owner's information.